first we need to open FBI in our 3DS, select Remote Install, and then scan QR code. You'll scan the QR code with a link in the description down below, and this will update the latest version of Universal Updater. Next, we're going to open Universal Updater from our home menu, and we're going to install the TW Patch package. Next, we're going to return to the home menu and launch the latest icon, which will become a present. We'll unwrap it, and then we're going to open it. Once it has loaded, we're going to hold the Y and B button to open the patch menu. Next, we're going to enable widescreen patch and GPU scaling. Next, we'll press the B button and then the Start button to generate a twlbg.cxi file. Once it's done, which will take about two minutes, we're going to open FBI again. We're going to select SD, Luma, and then Sys Modules. We're going to move the twlbg file, so we're going to copy it, and once that's copied, we're going to go back to the SD, and we're going to go to NDS. Next, we'll go to Twilight Menu, and we'll have to make a folder called TWLBG, and it needs to look exactly like this. Once we've created that folder, we will need to paste the file we copied. We will need to rename that to widescreen.cxi, and it has to be spelled this way exactly. Next, we'll go to the home screen and exit FBI. We're going to turn off our 3DS, and while turning it back on, so before you do, we're going to hold the select button and hold the power button, and this will bring up Luma 3D. We're going to enable external firms and modules. Then we'll press the start button to save and quit. Then we're going to open Twilight Menu++, plus plus, and whenever we get to our DS game that we're wanting to play, we're going to press the Y button. If we scroll all the way down, we can select what aspect ratio we want to play the game at, and we'll select 16 by 10. And that's it. Thanks for watching.